Welcome back. I'm here with Diana Needham from the National Trout Festival, and it's going to be a gorgeous weekend for it, that's for sure. Yeah. Now, there's a lot of events. Obviously, there's going to be trout fishing, which you were saying that it may not be the best for that because it's cold. The water's very cold, but there's a ton of other stuff going on as well. There is. Um, thank you, Megan, for yeah. having me here this morning. Um, the children's fishing contest starts Saturday morning about 9 o'clock, and we plant trout there, so we oh, know there's okay, fish great. for them to catch. Yeah. <laughs> and there's prizes for everybody that catches something. And um, very young to, to teenagers are out there in force. I mean, we have Definitely. hundreds of kids out there. It's, it's very good for them. And then, of course, there's a uh, fishing contest going on for adults through Jack Sports Shop. Okay. And uh, there's yeah. money and, and prizes. Yeah. This video from last year. That's from, yeah, no, that's from this year. This is oh, opening this ceremonies. Year. Yep, that's the opening ceremonies Wednesday night where we're crowning the trout king. <laughs> the Did you see that king. crown? I love it's it. It's been around for 100 years. We have really? these nice, beautiful new ones, and they always wear the old metal one. Is that yeah, right? That's true. That is awesome. <laughs> yeah. Now, obviously, yeah, like we said, there's going to be fishing, but I mean, there's it's basically parades, festivals. Tell me a little bit about what else is we going on. We have two parades on Friday. We have the youth parade, uh, which starts at 2 o'clock, um, and that's the, the younger kids, and of course, there's only a half day of school, so right. the kids can come out to it. Then Saturday, we have the Grand Royale Parade, that's sponsored by the uh, Great Lakes Energy at yeah. 2 o'clock, and usually there's 100 entries at least wow. or so, and it's a, it's a good parade. That's great. And then uh, Scottville Clown Band will be here this year. Okay. If you have not seen them, they're hysterical <laughs> um, and they will also be playing at the Shady Bell when it's done in the Shady Bell is okay. a place where it's um, entertainment goes Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and um, it's mostly local entertainment right. on Saturday, and mostly local people like Pat Stuck, uh, Patty Cox, um, there's some local bands and stuff, yeah. Evergreen play there. So people come out because it's, it's our own people there, you know. And then, um, uh, of course, there's a carnival, Skirbeck's Carnival, and there's a car show, an ugly truck contest. I did see pictures yeah. of that. Yeah. That looks so much fun. There's a handbell <laughs> uh, concert on uh, Friday night, which is very interesting. Uh -huh. She plays, this is a single gal who plays 37 handbells, oh, and generally my. they're played by seven to nine people. Wow. And she does them herself. It's, it's phenomenal. That is yep. awesome. And, um, of course, we have... Um, uh, the Troutzilla Teen Music Center tent. Uh, <laughs> not my music, but yeah. the teenagers love it, so we want them there too, you know. That so is great. It is. You're saying this is the 77th year for it, not annual though. No, 77th yeah. year. They took a few years off back during the war and the depression right. because they couldn't afford to do it, so yeah. it's really just the 77th. Okay, great. <laughs> but we're proud of that. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely. Yeah. So there's going to be lots of entertainment. You also said that there will be kind of a flea market going on? There's a flea market going on that takes place from Thursday to Saturday. Sunday, if the weather's nice, a lot of times the vendors will stay open yeah. longer. Okay. And then there's a craft show in the Coliseum, but that's only on Saturday. Okay. And we have a lot of vendors, almost 100 vendors, Definitely. so it's a, it's a flea market worth walking and through. And you said Saturday is going to be the busiest day, and S looks like Sunday, you said it usually routes up early, but it's going to be beautiful out, so yeah. you're going to want to stick around. We're hoping that they'll stay a little longer. You know, a lot of the times the carnival will stay open even a little longer if okay. the weather's nice on Sunday. And for a full list of events, where should we go? No, nationaltroutfestival.com. Awesome. Easy load. You can that's find it right. easy. Mm -hmm. Well, it's going to be a gorgeous week, and I hope you can get to get out and enjoy it. I know a lot of people come out for this, so thank you so much for coming in, thank Diana. Thank you so much for having us. We appreciate of it. Of 